This is the mysterious Amazon rainforest, the world's largest and most biodiverse rainforest in the world. It's a place that has mystified explorers and scientists for centuries. The realm where the known meets the unknown, a vibrant ecosystem that is as mesmerizing as it is intimidating. With its dizzying array of flora and fauna, the Amazon is a living, breathing testament to the remarkable diversity of life on Earth. But it is also a land of secrets, of stories yet to be discovered and told. As we journey into the heart of this verdant labyrinth, we will encounter the strange, the beautiful, and the downright mysterious, from ancient hidden civilizations to elusive creatures of legend. Let us uncover some of the hidden gems of the Amazon. Have you ever wondered what mysteries lurk beneath the dense canopy of the Amazon rainforest? In January 2024, researchers found a huge, ancient city that was only previously detected by LIDAR, hidden for thousands of years by lush vegetation. Who knows what further mysteries these 2,500-year-old cities hide inside? That will potentially change our understanding of our world as it happened with the Mayans. The Amazon is teeming with life, some of which remain unknown to us. It's believed to house countless undiscovered species, strange and mysterious beings or creatures, each with a story waiting to be told. One such story is of the legendary beast. From the ancient cities to the mysterious creatures, the Amazon rainforest is a treasure trove of enigmas. But let's shift our gaze from the ground to the water now. The Amazon River, the lifeblood of this vast forest, holds mysteries of its own. Among these is a creature that can light up the darkness in an instant. Meet the electric eel, a testament to the Amazon's mysteries and hidden powers. Despite their name, electric eels are not eels, but a type of knife fish. They can reach lengths of up to eight feet and are known to produce shocks of up to 600 volts, five times the power of a standard US wall socket. These creatures use their electric powers for hunting, self-defense, and navigation. Now, that's what I call a shocking lifestyle. Electric eels are solitary creatures that prefer to lurk in the muddy bottoms of calm or stagnant waters. Here, they lay in wait for their prey, ready to unleash a jolt of electricity that would leave any unsuspecting creature stunned and ready for the taking. Their unique ability to generate electricity has puzzled scientists for years. With each new study, we learn more about these fascinating creatures and their electrifying existence. But remember, the Amazon is a vast and mysterious place, and the electric eel is just one of many enigmatic inhabitants. One such mysterious furry inhabitant isn't your average furry friend from the woods. Hidden deep within the thick, untamed brushes of the Amazon, this creature stirs up quite the fuss. We're not chatting about a lost puppy or a wayward squirrel here, but a colossal, stinky, hair-covered monster about 6 meters or 19 feet tall. Accounts by Indians of the Amazon region describe the elusive animal as terrifying, dangerous, physically powerful and equipped with some kind of chemical defense capable of paralyzing opponents. This isn't make-believe, it's the Amazon's very own Mapinguari. This big bad beast was first bumped into by the globe-trekking cryptozoologist David Oren. This legendary creature is said to skulk around a massive four-mile radius, leaving behind a trail of terror and a smell that could beat a garlic breath. A creature so big you could mistake it for Bigfoot, just make sure you're upwind from it. But all jokes aside, this legendary monster is more than just a local scare story. It is full of local myth and tradition which forms a significant part of the indigenous tribe's belief system. Stories tell of a powerful spirit, the Mapinguari, or to the locals, who's capable of causing quite the stink. To the tribal people, it's more than just a creature, it's a spiritual symbol bridging the physical world to the one. A creature that's got more stink than a garbage dump. Now that's what I call a legendary beast. The boiling river, as locals call it, has intrigued scientists for years. The water in some sections can reach temperatures of up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit, 93 degrees Celsius, a temperature lethal for most forms of aquatic life. 200 degrees Fahrenheit is not quite at boiling point, but it's hot enough to poach your egg and kill anything that falls into it. According to oral traditions, the Boiling River is a place of tremendous spiritual power, a home to very powerful jungle spirits, where only the most powerful shamans could go because other people were afraid of the spirits. 
Let us now discover the whispers of the Amazon, the whispering trees, the enchanted guardians of the Amazon's secrets. Now, you might be thinking, are these scriptwriters finally losing it? But this is real. The trees of the Amazon have a story of their own. You see, when the wind rustles through the dense foliage, the trees seem to whisper secrets of the forest. But these whispers aren't just for dramatic effects, folks. They play a crucial role in indigenous communication. The tribes have learned to decipher the subtle rustling of leaves, using these whispers to navigate the vast expanse of the rainforest, to predict weather changes, or even to sense danger lurking nearby. These whispering trees are the Amazon's very own nature-made walkie-talkies, stringing together the physical world with the spiritual, the mundane with the mystical. So the next time you hear the rustle of leaves, remember, it might just be the trees sharing secrets. We now explore the lives of the indigenous tribes. These communities, deeply rooted in the heart of the Amazon, are its true custodians. Their intimate knowledge of the forest and its secrets is unparalleled, word of mouth passed down through generations. They coexist harmoniously with the forest. They understand its rhythm, like the people in the Avatar movie, respecting its might and using its resources sustainably. However, life in the Amazon is not without its challenges. The tribes face limited access to essential services, a reality intensified by the forest's dense vegetation and challenging terrain. The Amazon, while a home, is also a battleground. Territorial conflicts arise due to the exploitation of the forest's resources by big companies, with indigenous tribes often finding themselves on the front lines, defending their lands without legal backing. Despite these trials, the indigenous tribes of the Amazon continue to honor their traditional ways, serving as a beacon of resilience and sustainability. They are the true guardians of the Amazon. Their role is crucial in the preservation of this precious ecosystem. Let us now go deeper into the forest, to the uncontacted tribes. These tribes are a fascinating enigma, living in the heart of the Amazon, untouched and oblivious to the modern world. Their isolation is not accidental, but a choice, a decision to live apart from the constantly advancing world around them. Thankfully, their presence in the Amazon has inadvertently led to the protection of large forest areas. By living in harmony with the forest, they serve as guardians of this rich and biodiverse ecosystem. Their presence is a powerful deterrent to illegal loggers and miners who might otherwise exploit these lands. However, their isolation also brings controversy and ethical dilemmas. Should we reach out to them, we would be exposing them to modern technologies, diseases, and potential conflicts. We should respect their choice to remain uncontacted, preserving their unique ways of life and their invaluable knowledge of the Amazon's mysteries. These tribes are a living testament to the resilience and adaptability of the human spirit. What can we learn from their sustainable way of life? How can we apply their wisdom to our own societies? Still living in harmony with nature, these tribes are a testament to the human spirit's resilience and adaptability. A bit of modern Amazon history, let's meet the Amazon's first Western explorer. In the heart of the 16th century, a daring Spanish explorer named Francisco de Orellana embarked on a journey that would etch his name into the annals of history. He was the first Westerner to traverse the mighty Amazon River, a feat previously thought impossible due to the dense, unyielding jungle and the river's fearsome reputation. Orellana's odyssey was one of unrelenting courage and resilience. His crew battled hostile conditions, navigated treacherous waters, and endured encounters with indigenous tribes. Despite these trials, they forged ahead, driven by a thirst for discovery and the human spirit's innate desire to unravel the mysteries of the unknown.